What's up guys, this is Sim with Vengeance and I am back here with another announcement video. And today we are going to reveal the team that we have for the Madden NFL 17 franchise. So during this offseason we've had some big trades, we've had some pretty good drafts. A lot of teams are really trying to get themselves a new image. There's been a lot of teams that even, or there's been one team that even moved from St. Louis to Los Angeles. <clears throat> And that's not the team I'm using, though. That's no. Um, I didn't want to even consider it because <coughs> there's just a whole spectrum of YouTube that's probably going to do it anyway. Um, when I do my franchises, I want them to be unique. I want them to be cool, and I want them to have some sort of you know building process to it. So this team has been through a lot of, I should say, hardship uh, over the past <coughs> about say 20 to 30 years. Um, they haven't really been good. They've been kind of they've had these like Superstars that have just kind of came and went and it's just kind of a bad situation and This team also I feel like has a lot of potential to try and fix this before it's too late They still have good talent on this team offensively and somewhat defensively too They they need to get better in a lot of areas obviously obviously because um they just lost probably with their biggest superstar, probably the biggest superstar in all of football. But um, <clears throat> anyway, I've taken a lot of consideration into this, and for my team in Madden NFL 17, I'm going to run with the Detroit Lions. And the reason that is is because obviously they just lost Calvin Johnson. Calvin Johnson was, in my opinion, the best receiver in the league. Maybe even ever. I mean, the dude was like 6'6", six, 6'5". Six, six, like, I think they were giving him 6'5", to make him seem like he wasn't as tall. But I guarantee you, if you probably stand him up to next to, like, Kobe or something like that, he'd be 6'6". Six, six. And he could jump up and he could go up and get it. He has ups. He has speed. This guy, he almost played like a tight end. He was strong. This guy was the, the most well-rounded receiver I think I've ever seen play the game and he just retired now I've heard speculation when I went to go pick up this hat actually funny thing um, I asked you know it's like I asked for a lion's hat and he's like why do you need a lion's hat I'm like just because I need to do it for this and <clears throat> he's like oh, well what do you think about Calvin retiring I'm like it kind of sucks he's like I think he's gonna come back but I'm, he's gonna go play for a contender which that's just his opinion I don't know if he's gonna stay retired Honestly, something tells me he might come back, but I think the chances of that are actually slim. So, um, he seemed pretty content with his retirement when he came out and said it and did his little E60 special or whatever. Um, I think he seemed pretty content with his retirement decision. I'm not sure if he'll come back. Maybe he will, maybe he won't. Will he be the same player if he does come back? Maybe. But uh, I honestly think that Calvin Johnson, you know, was the biggest factor in how the Lions were going to succeed. And now that he's not there, this team needs help. A lot of help. And Matthew Stafford is a bit of a gunslinger. And we need to fix that. Um, if we cannot fix that in the franchise, then I guess I have to draft a quarterback or something. But this team needs a lot of help. And this might be my most difficult uh, franchise yet. Uh, but it's going to be fun. You know, I've had a lot of fun doing these franchises you get with you guys. You guys, you guys. you guys make it fun. That's what That's what I really like about these franchises. You guys make it fun. You guys make it like better for me and in the long run and that's what i love about these franchises that i'm doing is that you guys make it so much better for me as just like a person like it's just fun i like doing this <clears throat> defensively the lions need a lot of help too uh, uh the dominican sue wants a good defensive president obviously playing for my team that i'm using right now the miami dolphins and they still got a pretty decent d line it's not like it's terrible um <clears throat> I would say their biggest weakness is in their secondary, um, but we can. We, I, I'm hoping we can fix that too. Um, but that's to be determined. Obviously, we have a lot of things that we need to fix first. We need we need a running game. We need more receivers. Uh, obviously, Matthew Stafford pretty much has no one to throw to now besides Pettigrew. Um, J uh, Bell isn't really that you know that well known as a running back. He's not like that guy who's going to rush for 1,200 yards a season. Um, <clears throat> other than that, 
I hope you guys are kind of enjoy uh, enjoy this decision of me running with this team in Madden 17. Uh, I will probably get started on playing with the lines a little bit off off you know the re off the videos or whatever, and I'll see what I can do with this team at the beginning of the franchise. And it's gonna be fun, guys. I'm hoping you guys are excited for it. I am too. You guys should be. And you know what? <laughs> Sometimes, you know, if I know you sometimes you guys ask me to run with certain teams, and that's perfectly fine. But I mean, in my own head, I'm just sitting there like, um, you know, this that question is asked, you know, I gotta ask myself questions like, is this actually a good team to use? And this was pretty much like the ultimate decision, like, this is why I chose the lines. I give you guys my explanation, and I, I'm hoping you guys at least, you know, are excited for it. If you guys aren't, I mean, I hope you guys are, will come around eventually. But if you guys are enjoy, if you guys did enjoy the announcement video, hey, drop a like. And if you uh, have a Twitter account, follow me on Twitter. The links in the description. If you follow me, hit me up. I'll follow you back. Simple as that. Um, but until next time, my name is Sin, and I'm out. Peace.